Okay. First, you should open the live suit. Then, you should open the executable file. Now, you can see this box. And then, you should select the image file that you are going to install on the tablet. It is also known as the firmware file. Okay, you select this former file that you have downloaded. Okay. Okay, here's the solution to the tricky part now. Most of the users will find problem connecting their computer and their tablets or their mobiles. So, at first you have to connect your data cable to a computer. In this case, I've connected my data cable permanently to my computer. So now get the data cable and keep pressing your back button of your tablet or mobile continuously and then press your power button repeatedly like this and insert the jack. Okay, then here we can see some progress. See, it is showing that it is installing device drivers. See, it's trying to update from the internet. And see, it cannot find the driver. So, we're going to install it manually. So, first we go to the prop to the manage and we go to device manager and here we see it's showing an unknown device click in the update device drivers then browse in the computer and select the driver that you have downloaded previously that is located in your folder where you have the live suit so I have it here and I'm gonna select the whole folder here live suit and it's gonna find the driver by itself and it's gonna install it yeah and this message will come and click on install Then your driver will be installed in very short time, but be patient. Okay, now we have installed the driver. This is the most problematic part that I just saw. Now, it just saw an option that to upgrade. Yes, this um, and this is the success. Now you can install the driver or the firmware from here, and you can recover your bricked tablet or mobile. Thank you.